toes are nice and wide, and press the big toe down. <laughs> and tap the big toe down, down. And tap the big toe down. It's four, three, and two. All 10 toes back up, guys. And really spread out wide. And then slowly press the little toe down. And now tap the little toe down and down. While you're standing here, start to check your posture as well. Start to pull the abs in, start to brace your rib cage and your shoulders back and down, go press. Yes, that's it. It's for us, for us who are used to the computer. This is very unnatural, but that's the way you should be. Uh, roll it back and down, press. Now guys, from here, let's swap the toes. So it's go over big toe, little toe, and big toe, little toe, and big toe, little toe, and let's go even faster. It's big toe, little, big toe, little, big toe, little. Don't worry if all the others start to wiggle, that's normal. And now can you close your eyes and go even faster? Don't worry about what it looks like, just go. Woo, it's big toe, little, big toe, little, switch, 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 yeah. switch, and switch. Oh my God, my eyes are closed and my, all my toes are wiggling. And even my legs are moving, even my ankles are moving. Four and three and two. Well done, squid. Ready? Have a relay, have a nice relaxation. And shimmy, shimmy, shimmy out. Now stretch over the feet. Go stretch and stretch. Just the five and four and three and two. Nice one. Step out wide, 10 toes pointing forward. Let's take it to the side. And it's four and three and two. Have a whole look up. Breathing center and look down without moving the body. Stretch out those neck and lift up. Take a rotation in the waist, send it to the all corner of the room. Finding a nice long straight flat back, pulling the abs in tight, now start to hover all the way down towards the floor and then come to the center. Hamstring stretch, here we go. Now slowly bend the knees, slowly straightening the legs. Slowly bend the knees, slowly double time. Here goes guys, take it, bend and stretch. It should feel really quite nice. Yeah? Yeah. Tail, your sitting bone going lighter and higher to the side, and your head, the crown of the head going heavier towards the floor. Two more, down, and stretch. Last one, hold the leg straight, as straight as you can. Now stick the bum to the sky, so really get a hamstring on. Ooh, now everyone shake out the head, and nod the head and shake the head. Now soften the knees, scoop the ass in, roll up, and up, and shoulders back, take it down. And four, and three, and two. Let's go over the other side. Take it across. Here we go, pressing four and three and two and freeze. Now look up and come back to center and look down without moving the body. Nice, nice stretch, then center and then lift up. Take a rotation in the waist and send it across the room, find that flat back. Now slide it all the way down, come back to the center. Maybe you hold the ankles this time, inhale, bend, exhale, stretch, inhale, bend, exhale, last two. And then last one, slowly stretch out, hold the stretch using your arm. Pulling the body closer, yeah. Shake out the head. Now relax the arms on the floor, soften the knees, guys. And roll up four and three. Well done, now shoulders back, let's pick up the pace. Four and three, here we go. Back to the first side, just one and two. And reach for two and down. For two, center, lift up to a flat back, fingertips on the floor, push the hips side to side. Go side and side, the hips side. To side and side. Now start to go to the nice side to side lunges. You start to bend the knees and take the body side to side with the legs. Then side and side and side. Just the eight. Now this is a flat back. So even though the fingertips are there to support you, you're really, really pulling the abs in here. Just the eight more. And seven and side and side. Here's four and three and two. Nice one, guys. Come back to the center and hover right, right over your legs into hamstring stretch and roll it up four and three and now of course to the other side take it across and two and flat back for two and down this time you come straight to a flat back if you need the fingertips on the floor to start go there otherwise both arms by the ear now side and side straight away side to side lounges if you need the support keep the hands on the floor otherwise arms by the ear side and side nice one now you've got to work the abs now otherwise your lower back will start to hurt yeah pull the abs in and side for four and three and two. Now come back to center, bending both legs. So it's like a really wide squat. Yes, go side. And now start to lift body up to 45 degrees. Go inside, that's it. I hope that's clear. That's it, so it's a squat. That just now you are flat back horizontal. Now you're up, go in, sit and sit. Now guys, you should be able to lift all 10 toes up off the floor. So your weight is in the heel, go. And drop it, four, eight, seven, and six. It's a squat, and four, Three, that's what guys, right heel up and keep the right heel up. Sit down lower, here we go. 
Let's press and press into that squat, uneven squat. And it's eight, seven, and six, five. I'm getting warm already, three. And now from here, bring the right heel down, set the feet together, right legs in. Now here you go, arms into the arms, going pump. Now cardio, here you go, drop. And now these arms are important, yeah. It may it really work those arms. It's like a mini push up. That's it. Top press. Well, eight and seven and six. It doesn't feel like a lot. It, we do a lot of it, so it just built up. Now, guys, set the right leg out wide. Back to that wide leg squat. Let's carry on. Sit. Go press and press and press. Four more like this. And four. And now legs stepping together. Right leg coming back in. in four, three. And then right leg goes four, four and three and two, right leg come back in, four, four, and three, and two, now for two, going out, for two, and in, pop those arms guys, and out, for two, I promise you, you will feel this up, and out, for two, and in, for two, and out, you can guess what happened, let's go singles, here we go, one out, one in, wide, one close, yes, well, pump those arms guys, go push up, push up, pump those legs, pump, and pump, that's it, well done. And squeeze, and four, and three, and two. Now, where we are, bring the legs out wide. We're back to that squat. Now, drop again. Now, the back is hovering forward quite a lot. Your abs have to work so hard, otherwise your back will hurt. Now, arms back up, so you're back to that 45 degrees. Watch the heels, heels come up and lower. Heels come up and lower. Heels come up and lower. Yes, the legs are nice and wide, that's it. Just open shoulders back. Oh, nice. And look, last two. Now, guys, stay on those toes. Stay on those toes. Well done. Now, drop and drop and drop and drop. Just a four. Not here for long, guys. Now, from here. Now, from here, you out and back to parallel. Turn it out. But you're still in the squat. You're still. So, the legs turn it out and to parallel. Yes. And turn it out. And now, double time. Let's switch. Going out. And press out and out and out. Just the eight, seven. Can you see any lower and lower? Come on, four and three and two. Now stay on the tippy toe, lift the body up. Magically, it's now a plie. Nice one. Hands to the hips and both heels down. Maybe you might need to adjust them and let's sit. Hi, guys. And it's eight, seven, and six, and five. I promise a bit of cardio now from here, right heel. Both arms up, shoulders down, and the heel, right leg up, right leg lower. Yeah, so now it's going to be familiar. Now, double time. Take it up and low. Hit up and low. And up. One more. Hold it up. Square up the pelvis and drop. Let's go. Go sit and sit. Rib cages in, abs in, nice and tight. Four, eight, seven. Don't hold. Down hold. And four. And we know where this is going to. So from here, arms open and turn. And open. Yes. And turn. Just the two more like this. Next bit is very familiar. We've done this. I haven't changed much. Now, next up, hold it here. And make sure you make your adjustment. So the legs are as wide as the hips. Arms in cactus. Now drop. Yes. Now, these bits are familiar. We've done this. So no panic. Yeah, you anticipate the pain. But it's nothing new right here. And four. Three, here we go, guys. We go all the way down. Back knee touch the floor. Float up halfway. Exhale. Inhale down. Exhale halfway up. Inhale down. Exhale halfway up. Inhale down. Exhale four more. Well done. The halfway up, guys, it's a break. Come on. We never come any higher than halfway up after this. Oh my God. Two more. Come on. All the way down. Halfway up. Next time you go all the way down. Come halfway up, and now the arms slide down, and the fingertips on the floor. Now, back knee, back touch the floor. Come up five centimeters. Yes. Down the floor, and up only five centimeters, guys. So, touch down, up. And now, when you're ready, we add the body, touch down, and the body come up when this yeah? Touch down, and up. Reaching down, reaching up. Yes, down. But the knee never lift higher than 5 cm. So, down up yes scoop the abs in otherwise you will throw the back so scoop the abs in to support the back nice strong core down and up inhale exhale four more down breathe out the lift inhale exhale last two yes 
Last one, hold it down right here. Now tap the back knee down. I know your legs are on fire. I know you're desperate to straighten the legs. Tap down, yes, 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 down. And it's eight, seven, and six, five, four. Now keep the legs doing exactly just that. One hand on the front side, the other hand on the front side, and carry on tapping down. Oh my God, oh my God. Eight more, come on, up and drop. Eight more, nice one, four more, come on, four. Three and two, nice one. Now have a quick stretch. Have a quick stretch, well done. Keeping the legs in that position. And wall the hands forward. So you are in the forward fall, like in the beginning. So we went from side to now every, the feet are parallel. You come back to the, just like when we in the beginning. Now go into the side to side lunges again. Yes, and side. And the arms up when you're ready. And side, side, go side. Of course, the option you can rest the hands on the side if you prefer. But eight, seven, oh, six, five, and four, three, and two. Hold on back to the center now, drop and drop. So it's a squat, it's a wide squat. Go drop. Both legs bending equally. And now start to lift the body up to 45 degrees and drop and drop. Just a four and three and two. Now from here, left heel is up, hands back on the side. Left heel. Now drop. So you're on one. The left, the left heel is up. So you're on one toe and one foot. And drop it. For five, four, three, and two. Nice one. Now step the left leg to the right leg and carry on. Now back to the arms. Press and pump those arms. Squat and squat. Just sit eight and sit. Yes, pump those arms. Come on. Nancy, bend and straighten the arms. Work those arms. Yeah, you're keeping them bent. So straighten up. Come on, push up. That's it, brother. And for four and three. Well done, guys. Now step back, back out wide again. Go for eight, seven, six. So now we're moving the left leg. Yes, four, three. Now for four. Here we go. Legs together. Four, three, two. Legs out. Four, four, and three. And now for two. Legs in one and two. And out for two. And in for two. Guys, singles. Let's go. Yes, in one and out and in. Oh, my arms are burning. <laughs> and in. Who knew without those little, little, little handy weights, we can still work the arms. And four and three and two. Nice one out wide. Arms up. Well done, everyone. <laughs> Stay right here. Now, both heels up and low. Both heels up. You're still parallel. You're still in the squat. You're still sticking the bum back. Yes. Last two. Now, stay up and from here. Knees out and pressing out and pressing out into that turn out. Go into the glute, outer side. Press and press. And can you sit down any lower? Now, it goes without saying, if your shoulders are hurting, hands can come down. And press. Eight more like that. Yes, for eight, seven, six, five. Yes, four and three. Guys, hold down and hoist the body upright. From squat to plie. Yes. Now, calmly bring both heels down. And then let's sit, yes. Now, you might find that you need to adjust your feet slightly. Yeah, there you go. Drop it, go down. I thought I was being smooth. We'll see. And drop. Now we're gonna lift the left heel. And three, well done guys. Now sitting nice and low, left heels up. This is nice and slow, catch your breath. Left heels up. Now double time guys, here we go. It's up and low, and up and lower. Two more, hold it up. Oh, guys, let go, sit. It's nice to be some way more familiar. Let's drop it, let the arms burn. Yes, and sit, and sit. Just the eight and seven. I hope you're all stretching, I am. And four, it's getting cold, yes. Now open the arms out while well done, inhale. Exhale, nice and calm. Here we go, next sequence. And open back out, three more like that. Close, and open, and close, and open. Of course, last one, hold on to the parallel and make any adjustment you need so the legs are not overcrossed. And let's sit, yes. Go press, press. If you're worried, make sure you're near something you can hold. Prepare the arms in cactus position, guys. Here we go. Back knee all the way down, come up halfway. Back knee all the way down, halfway up. Yes, back knee all the way down. Now guys, you never relax at the bottom because I find that you guys will drop the last two centimeters. Just really keep working all the way down. Halfway up hold, yes. Three, three more, all the way down. Halfway up hold. Nice, gorgeous, all of you, come on, come on. Yes, Ula. 
Last one. Now you come all the way down, halfway up, hold it here, slide the hand down, scoop the abs in and come forward, fingertips on the floor. Now watch my back knee. It touched down, two cm up. Down, five cm up, and down. I mean five centimeters, about two inches. Yeah, and down. Now when you're ready, you touch down, you reach the sky, and touch down, and up, and inhale, exhale, breathe in. Eight more, come on. Inhale, exhale. Now the legs never come up higher than 5 cm. Yes, it's down and up. Four more touch down and up. Three more touch down and up, guys. Last two. Yes, last one. Come on. Now fingertips back down. Let's tap and tap. Let it burn. Let it burn. Yes, I know you're very tempted to just straighten the legs. Come on, tap and tap. Breathe through it. It's moments like this, you really start to make changes. Otherwise, you are just in a comfort zone. Why would you want to do that? And four, well done, guys. Now, be brave. One hand on the front side, the other hand. Now, carry on tapping the back knee. And down. Oh, eight more. Down, and down, and down, and down. Here's four, three, two. Guys, stretch it out, stretch it out. Oh, my God, it's a joke. Oh, stretch it out, well done. Now, gently. Turn the feet parallel again, come back to center, have a quick stretch here. Into side to side, right though, hold on to opposite elbow and have a quick bit of dangle. Release any tension in your back. And now roll your way up. Grab a quick drink if you need to. And now make our way to the bar. And make our way, grab your chair, grab your table. And we're gonna start facing the bar. Yes, well done. Hydration guys, hydration. If you wait until you feel thirsty, it's a little late, yeah. I say that I'm always like dying, but <laughs> nice. Well, from here now, next bit is familiar. You all done this, yeah. So lift up. Observe my fingertips to that back foot is one straight line from here. Hamstring curl and stretch. My right leg is the one curling and stretching right now. Yes, and curl and stretch and curl. Not that I, not that it really matters to be honest. You work the leg that is weak, that is a bit more challenging for you. I like to tackle the side that is a bit more challenging for me. But if you prefer to hear me say right or left, then just, just go with that. Four more. Some people really don't like it. And a friend of mine is very dyslexic. She finds the comment right and left very confusing. Now squeeze up, heel to the bum. Now squeeze, squeeze, and squeeze, squeeze. Remember you're facing your thumb. You can put the hands down anytime you like. Go squeeze. Oh, just hands prayer position. Bottom knee is nice and bent. Press and press. Holding on to combination for five and four. Well done, guys. Combination here. We'll have a look. One squeeze, one lift. One squeeze, one lift. One squeeze, one lift. The body has to be kept really agile. They have to be made for sort the of challenge with different kind of movement. So it's not just the same thing repeatedly. One squeeze. Now, guys, keep that squeeze as tight as you can. And then lift and lift and lift and lift. So lift and lift the heel constantly. Try to get the heel to the bum. At least with your head, you focus on that. Four, you feel the hamstring sing in a nice tune. And press. It's four and three. Nice, guys. Now, both hands on the bar, point the toes. Now, turn it out and cross the leg behind. Yeah? So, turn it out without moving the hips and cross behind. Now, you can let go again once you're ready to let go. Now, four more. Turn it out and cross behind. Three more out. The hips, the pelvis don't move at all. Pelvis completely square and cross. Last one. Now cross it behind. Pull the body up a bit straighter. Now single leg squat. Go drop. Yes. Go drop and drop. Yes. Single leg squat. And it's eight, seven, and six. <laughs> yes. Well, four. Now it's like when you're a child, you're desperate for the loo. Yes. Well, four. So those inner side going out and out. And another extra four. And three, well done. Now, you turn that back up. So into the attitude, let's circle, 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 circle. Yes, circle, circle. Remember which direction you circle, guys. And it's five, four, three, and two. Now, both elbows down onto your floor. From here, you bring the knee out to the side and straighten the leg and bend and send the leg behind you again. So from here to the side, stretch, bend, send it back and side, stretch, bend, send it back. Yes, yeah, so start completely parallel, both hips facing the floor. I'm just grabbing a chair and bend. Four more, it's side and stretch and bend, send it back. Three more, side and stretch, 
and then send it back. Last two. Yes, so we're not opening to sideline. It's completely parallel. You're facing the floor. Now keep the leg out to the side. Flex the foot and lift and lift. Oh my God. And lift and lift. Yes, my both butt cheeks on fire, guys. And lift. And it's eight, seven. Can you keep that leg as straight as you can? Yes, for five, four, three. Hold it here. Point the toes all the way down and all the way up. <laughs> Inhale. Exhale. Double time that tongue and up. Tap it down and up. Inhale. Exhale. Breathe in. Four more. Only four more, guys. It's down and up. Three more. Down and up. Last two. And up. Hold it up. Hold. And bend the knees. And then send the leg behind you. No rush. Pointing the toes and come back up. Now circle the other way. Yes, circle the other way. But you know this bit. And now we're going to get down for good. So you get the left heel, left elbow down and the right hand up and open the hip now. Yeah. So from the parallel to now sideline, completely open. Now you can release the hands if you're feeling strong. I'm a bit fragile. I'm going to keep my hand down <laughs> and for circle and circle. It's five and four and three and two. Well done, guys. Straighten the leg. So now the leg is next to you. And we now knee towards the arm, uh, elbow and straighten out. And out, exhale in and in. So now it's a familiar sideline. The sideline we all know. Now, Nancy, can you not see? Yeah, now double time. Here we go. Bend it in, straighten out. Bend it in, yes. Bend it in, nice one. Yes, Ula, oh man. Four more in and stretch. Three more in and stretch. Last two. Now, guys, if you're feeling strong, arm in fifth. Now lift and lift and lift and lift. Oh, yeah, lift. And so this is purely nothing but oblique lift and lift and lift. Yes, now really make sure that foot is parallel, parallel. Yes, my toe, my toes, my hips, shoulders all facing you. Yes, completely parallel, lift and lift and lift. You get to get a stretch in five, four, three, and two. Now bend the bottom leg some more and calm down. Yes, take a nice side stretch and lift the leg straight leg. Take a nice stretch. Now you turn out the leg, elbow to the knee, yes? Take a nice stretch. Straight leg lift. That's parallel. Take a little stretch. Elbow to the knee, double time. You stretch and lift and stretch and bend. Go stretch and lift and stretch and bend. Inhale, exhale. Well done, guys. Oh, it should be quite freeing. Down and lift and down. Just two more for luck. And down and stretch. And down. I really try to find the angle so it's clear to you. But I'm not gonna keep the unit. Now hold down, everyone. Meet me here. How much more turn out can you get? And now press. Can you work the glutes so hard that this knee is pointing at the sky? And squeeze, squeeze. And it's eight, seven, and six, five. It's crazy. Four, three, and two. Well done. Elbow to the sky. Hand behind the head. And bring the knee back to the sky. It's forward stretch. Bend and back and forward, stretch and bend. Just a two more and forward, stretch and bend. And last one, it's right forward. Flex the foot, hold it here, breathe in and breathe out. Now lower leg to where it's manageable, straight leg, turn it out and in, turn it out. Well done. So this is all familiar. You've all done this, turn it out. Nice. Because I let you go quite low, do you care to travel a bit? So up five three centimeters and back down. <laughs> three more up and up and back down and down. Two more up and up and back down. Guys, last one. Hold it up and just turn it out and in. Turn it out and in. I have added on a new bit up to this. Turn it out. Just four more. It's four and three. Do not despair. Yes, let's go. And now point the toes. Sweep the leg back out to the side. Now from here. You go back to that, that stretch with the earlier arm. You're going to take a circle and the leg is in front. And take a circle and the leg go back to the side. Yes, come from here. A circle and forward and circle to the side. And circle forward and out to the side. And up. This is to finish whatever that's still left in the oblique, in the glutes. And last one, guys. Oh, I know. It's forward. And this time you take it all the way back. You curtsy like you're on stage. And then take a stretch. Well done, everyone. <laughs>
So stretch it out, stretch it out. Woo. So you might, the glutes might be really appreciated. So press forward into a flat back. Really let the belly button lead the way. And stick the bum behind you. Stick the bum behind you, yeah. Oh, five, four, three, and two, guys. Now the other leg. Oh, yeah. Nice one. Now we have a little, a little roll, roll up and down to release your spine. Now I'm going to stay sideways so you can see the knees are soft. My hands behind my head. Lift up. Now really scoop the abs in and round forward. Woo! The, you should feel great for the back. Keeping the knees bent so you can gently swing side to side at the bottom here. Release any tension that might be built up in the back. Five, four, three, and two. Now to center, soften the knees again and roll your way back up. Again, whoo, using your abs. Press all the way back. Nice one. Shoulders down. And everything have a shake out the other side. Here you go, guys. Lift up. Move your chair or whatever. Or turn to the other table from here. And squeeze and release. Remember how we started? Yes. Go squeeze and release. And squeeze. That's it. Go squeeze. That's it. Full range. Four more. Let go. Go squeeze. Release. And three. Hamstring curl. Last two. And now hold it up and just squeeze. Go squeeze. And squeeze. If this is horrible for you, hands to the chest. Squeeze. Or you can always hold on, guys. Yeah? And you are facing your support. Straight arm. And squeeze. Just a four. And three. Hold on tight, guys, and from here, one squeeze, one lift. One squeeze, one lift. You have to teach your body, make your brain, the muscles as agile as your head. So they can do two different things. It's a squeeze, it's a lift. It's a squeeze, four more. It's a squeeze, it's a lift. Three more squeeze and lift. Last two. Now hold on, squeeze as tight as you can and lift. And lift, and lift, and lift, and lift, and lift. And lift. And lift. And lift, eight more here, and it's eight. And lift, and four, and three. Nice and both hands on the bar, pointing the toes, and now turn it out, and then turn it in. Over turn, so cross behind, hollow inner side. Turn it out, and cross behind, without dropping the hips, turn it out. No movement in the pelvis. Yes, turn it out, and cross behind. Yes, two more. Turn it out, hips completely square and cross behind. That's a lot for this inner side. Now guys, keep the cross. And now find your balance, hands off if you can. Now single leg squat, go drop and drop. Yes, drop and drop and drop. That knee basically squeezed up against the front knee. And it's eight, seven, and six, five, oh, four, and three. Well done guys. Now hands back down and go back to the turn out. Let's say leg is behind you and circle. Now you remember which way you circle, guys, and it's up. Circle, circle, yes, yes, yes. And four, three, and now both elbows down into a flat back. My both hips are facing the floor. I turn it out to the side. Stretch, bend, send it back. Go side, stretch, bend, send it back, and side. Stretch it. Do not worry about the height. It's not high, yeah? Side, stretch. Bend, two more, and side, stretch, and bend. Last one, hand side, now hold on to the side. Flex the foot, and now lift, and lift, and lift. Now guys, both hips are facing the floor, yeah? Both hips are facing, I know it's awkward as hell. Yes, come on, up, and up, and it's eight, seven, and breathe out, and out, and four, and three. Well done, one point the toes, touch all the way down. And lift all the way up, yes. Touch all the way down. Now double time, guys. Here we go. It's down and up. Don't worry about the height. It's not meant to go very high. Both because both your hips are facing the floor. Four more. Touch down and up. Three more down and up. Last two. And now hold it up again. And posing up. Hold it still. Sorry, no posing, just hold still. And four and three and two. Nice one, bend the knees and send it back again. And now lift back up 45 degrees to finish off. You're circling the other way. <laughs> Circle that knee the other way. Circle. Now while you're doing that, you start to come down to the elbow. You start to open the body up. Yeah, so now you're going to lift the hip rather than keeping them parallel. You're going to lift it, arm in fifth, and circle, and four, and three. Well done, guys. You can hold on to the hip or arm to the fifth. And now send that knee to your chest and send it out. 
Now, if you're feeling fragile like me, that hand can come down and the knee can come towards your elbow and send it back, double time guys. Come in and back, exhale, inhale. Now, whichever verse, yes, come in and back. The knee and ankle and the feet are the same level. Last two, last one, hold it out and the arms up if you can and now lift and lift. Let's go lift. Yeah, exactly. Any adjustment you need. Now, I really emphasize this is all parallel. Yeah, my shoulders, chest, hips, and the toes pointing directly in front of me, not turn out, not go. Go for eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, guys. Point the toes, well done. Oops. And now take a nice stretch and straight leg lift. Yeah, nice stretch and knee to the sky, knee to the elbow, and lift. Straight leg lift. Stretch, knee to the sky, double time. Go stretch and up and stretch, knee to the elbow and stretch and lift. Go knee to the elbows, inhale, exhale, breathe in, four more. Now, sorry, three more. Last two, inhale. Nice, last one, guys. We're gonna meet knee with the elbow to the knee like so. Can you work that glute hard to open the knee out? Yes, guys, let's crunch and crunch and crunch and crunch. Yes, up and crunch and crunch. Just the eight more. It's eight, seven. Oh my God, the size. And four, three and two. Nice, our hands behind the head and bend that. So that knee is now, the foot leg, is, the foot is now behind you. And from here, guys, well done. Now send it forward, stretch and bend, send it back and forward. Very similar to this one. Yeah, and forward. Stretch and bend, send it back. Last one, forward, hold it here, hold it, breathe. Nice and still, straighten the leg. Five, four, three, and two. Now lower it to where it's manageable. Turn it out and in, turn it out and in. Turn it out, yes, guys. Now we're gonna travel, because it's nice and low, it's up. For two, and back down, and down. Hits up, and up, and back down. Just a two more trips, and up. Whew. And back down, guys, well done. And up, now as high as you can, finish here. Let's go. Turn it out and in. Turn it out and in. Turn it out. Now last four, can you get the hand behind the head again? Or aim the, open the chest, aim the elbow to the side. I know it's a hard version. Last one, nice and point the toes and sweep it back to the side. So remember the circle, release your arms. Now they circle and forward and circle back to the side. Going <laughs> as you move and circle back to the side. So it's forward in front of the hip and back to the side. Four more circle and forward and back to the side. And forward and back, just the two more. To finish off whatever that's left and back. Ooh. Last one, forward. Now guys, take it all the way back and curtsy. Oh my God, everybody. Now let's hit the floor. <laughs> so move your camera, Get grab a drink, whatever you need. Well done. We are going to, before we hit the floor, we're going to do some roll up and down. Yeah. So we just release, release whatever tension that might be built up. So here we go. You stand, stand in the air. Because we move our right leg first, we're going to go down with the right. We're going to go to the plank, go to the right leg first. I know. Now, feet to the end of the mat. Again, a few more rolls. So you're, when you hit the floor, the back feels nice and comfortable. Again, the feet as wide as the hip, knees are relaxed. Hands behind your head, guys. Well done. Now breathe in to lift and scoot forward. Roll all the way down. Breathe in, bend the knees. Breathe out, straighten your legs. Inhale, bend. Exhale, stretch. Two more. It should feel good. Now next one, you keep the knees bent, whatever is comfortable, and hold on to opposite elbow and just gently swing side to side. Release any tension in that back that might have built up. And side. Four more here. Eight, five, and four. And three and two, nice one. Hands on the floor, walk out to that plank. Here we are. Now right leg up and straight leg lift and lift and lift and lift. Yes, lift. And that straight leg going up and lift and press and press. Just a four. You got a little break coming up. So from here, you press back to downward dog, take the leg with you. So the right leg goes up, like standing splits and come back down to the plank. Yeah, the right leg staying up for two and down for two. Exhale up, inhale down. This is a little break. 
Just two more and we're gonna stay in downward dog. Nice one, last one. Now in downward dog, the right leg is up. Now from here, bend the right knee, so the right knee is pointing to the sky. And now you're gonna circle this knee. And circle, four, and three. Take a chance to release your neck, take a little break here. And now circle the other direction, circle. This is active recovery, yeah, and prepare. And now back to that standing split and come back to that plank. Right leg is still up, flex the foot, and hamstring curl and stretch. You know what's coming. Now start to dip the, the other knee down and straighten both legs, yes. Knee down and stretch, and down and stretch. Going down and stretch, and down. Just the two more, come on. That top leg never lift. Last one, now put the bottom knee down and straighten out the right leg and lift. Now from here, you can lift the bottom knee down for now, press up, so from here, you press down. But you see, my head to the back foot is one straight line, like a seesaw, yeah. And now, if you're feeling strong, last A, bottom knee comes off the floor. And down, and up, and down. Four more, come on. Everyone, bottom knee come off the floor, what are you doing? Yes, last two, yes, bottom knee come up. Now guys, hold the hold. Elbows bend, bottom knee off the floor. Can you get the bottom knee a bit closer? And five, four, three, and two, guys. <laughs> Have a quick stretch. <laughs> Let's a little break for your arms <laughs> into the abs. So uh, before we go to the other side, now I really like this because <laughs> it's so easy, but so challenging. So we all know the one yeah. from here. Take a nice little C curve, nice one. And then you start to open the chest again and catch yourself on your elbows. So try not to come up higher. You are on your elbows and I'm reaching forward and touching down. The other arm forward and touching down. One arm forward. Now your inner side, your pelvic floor is working like crazy. Lift the pelvic floor, both arms up, both arms down. It should be effortless, guys. I know, now if both arms is a bit too challenging, one arm at a time, guys. From here, and up, touch down, and up, touch down. Just the four and down, and three, and down. Last two, and now hold it up, well done. From here, little crunches up, and squeeze. They're very small, and tuck, yeah, exhale. Breathe out, shh, and out, and out. Lift, crunch, and squeeze, and squeeze, uh, uh, uh. And four, like you've just been punching it. Stomach, now hold it here. Right arm by the ear. Touch your elbows down. Go back up, and reach forward, the other side. By the ear, touch your elbow down, in, back up, and now back to the first side, guys. It's up, touch your elbows down, and back up, and lower, the other side. It's up, elbows down, yes. And now, do we dare to do both arms? Let's try it. And up, elbows down, and up, and fall. It's reach, elbows down, and come on. Yeah, how much adjustment can you not do? Yes, can you stay down? Oh, oh, oh. Last one. Oh God, elbows by, arms by the ear. And then crunching squeeze. If that's too much, hands forward, yeah? And crunch, and crunch. Yes, crunch, and crunch. Just the eight, I know your the abs are shaking that crazy, that's the whole idea. And four, three, and two. Now very calmly, very calmly, roll your way down. All the round guys. Nice, now lower abs. So you can imagine that was all core, but quite a lot of upper abs. So now legs up, either flex or point the toes on my reach. Now exhale, bump off the floor. Inhale, lower back down. Reverse crunch and up and lower. Nice one, so curl it up and hold and lower. Nice one, and curl it up and hold. No rushing, try to be able to hold at the top there and down. Two more, curl it up and hold and back down. Last one, hold it at the top. Now, little poses, go squeeze, go squeeze, go squeeze. Well done, guys, and pressing up. Go breathe out, and out, go squeeze up, and up. Just the eight, and seven, and up, and up, and four, and three, and two. Now, head and shoulders come up. Hands go behind your head and bring the bum down. So now, right now, it's nice and comfortable, yeah? Head and shoulders come off the floor. Everyone lower the leg to the point of challenge come two inches up. And all to the point of challenge, and up two inches, five centimeters. 
and down and up hold down hold up hold down hold up hold nice one the whole spine is glue on the floor up hold nice down hold i know horrible isn't it and down hold now double time it's down and up inhale down exhale up inhale down now do not despair guys you can go quite high as long as you keep the legs on that side of the hips the knee never go past your hips come on guys and down and up it's down come on come on and down and up anyone can do this with the legs higher you all can and by all of you i'm expecting a lot lower and down yes guys ah, last two and now the point of challenge turn out and now crisscross to finish come on the hardest point you have even if it's up here is fine everyone leg up come on crisscross last eight counts and crisscross do not stop last four and four and three and two yeah now you hug doesn't that feel great after you work hug the legs well done everyone now arms over your head legs out and give yourself a really good stretch you should feel a bit awkward yeah that you should feel oh my god ouch 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 but really enjoy it guys so really arch the back of the floor make yourself very very long whole back comes off the floor Ooh. it should feel great yeah because that was so such a straight straightforward sequence but it's really challenging well done you should feel like abs of steel now oh i hope you can hear me you should feel like abs of steel guys well done now calmly we roll over back out to the plank position and you know now the left leg yes here we go straight the lift is up and up nice one that's it so remember there's a bit of a break there's this the three the, the downward dog break so now straight they lift the left left leg up and it's up and up and five and four and three and hold now slowly push up to downward dog take the leg to the sky and back down to plank now it's up for two and down for two and up for two and down last two it's up for two and down nice one guys last one hold it up and bend the knees so the knees pointing at the sky nice open the hips now circle this knee really quite free in quite big circles yeah the biggest circle you can go and now reverse the direction Whew. the knee pointed at the floor the knee pointed at the sky last two give your head a shake so the neck is relaxed have a quick hold here straighten the leg back up and come back forward into plane flex the foot hamstring curl and bend the knee and straighten and bend now start to tip the, the other knee down and stretch the other knee down and stretch knee down and stretch so the leg that is up doesn't ever <laughs> yeah the leg that is up will stay up tap down come on higher higher guys get down and up last two <laughs> nice one now everyone have a little break here Put that knee down, straighten out the leg, take a deep breath in, abs in, now pressing down and up and down. That's it. So get used to working the glute so that leg never drops and down. Nancy, have a look at me and down and up and down. And now everybody, last eight, hover the bottom knee and press and up. Inhale and down. Nice one, down. Come on. Four more. Everyone, bottom knee comes up for the last three. And up, bottom knee comes up for the last two, yes. And now hold it halfway. The bottom knee is one centimeter of the mat, hold it here. Right, come on, bend those elbows, bend those elbows. And four, Nancy, bend the elbows. Well done, press back. <laughs> come on, it wouldn't be much fun unless there's some crazy planks in it. Well done, everybody, stretch back. And now this time, you just simply, yeah, I'm just gonna stretch back and you're gonna come forward onto your front well done everybody <laughs> have hydration if you need to and now we're going to go to some back work so you bring the you bring yourself into sphinx elbows under the shoulders chest open shoulders back well done everyone and we all know this one so really engage your glute and one arm up and put it down the other arm up and put it down nice one arm up and put it down one more up and down and up let's work even slower if you need to just making sure you are not having to you're not swing the body side to side yes yeah that's it so you're not leaning over to one side or the other one up and slowly down 
last one, whichever arm is up, hold it up. Now visualize your shoulder blade. Pull the shoulder blade towards your waist. Go lift and lift. Go lift and lift and lift. Yes, lift. And it's a, it's a shoulder blade that's pulling your arms. Yes, going up. Lift the arms. Come on. And up. Pass your ear if you can. Four, eight, seven, and six, five, and four, three, and hold. Hold. Come on. Nancy, we didn't do this in the lunch time. There's no, no reason we should be tired. Release the arms. Nice one. Shoulders away from the ears. Turn your head one way. Turn your head the other way. Nice one, guys. Now the other side. Release the arms. Now visualize your shoulder blades. So you're wrapping the muscles around the shoulder blades and they're pulling your shoulder blades to your waist. And now go in, lift and touch. Lifting up and up and up. So teaching your body, your arms are not flaring around. The arms in the center, like everything else. And lift. And it's eight, seven, and six, five, and four, three. Hold it. Well done, everyone. Five, four, three, and two. Nice one. Slowly down. Now, everybody, arms out, legs out like starfish. Breathe in here. And now, everyone, lift the opposite arm and leg. Think about how, how far you can reach, not how high. Slowly down. And then the other side. Really reach and slowly down. Down. Back to the first side. And low. Feel all that work across the body. And now four more. To each side. Lower. And up. And up. And lower. Last one. And up. And up. And lower. And one. And up. And up. Now the other side for everything is up. Join it. Breathe. And now little pedal. Go in pedal. And pedal. And pedal. And pedal. Yes, pedal. And pedal. You got eight more counts. Well done. And it's eight. Pull the abs in away from the floor. Come on, guys. And it's five, four, three, and two. Hold five, four, three, and two. Now cradle your hand, the head, and bring everything down. Now have a quick shake out. Yeah, have a quick wiggle. It's quite a lot of work for the back, but why not? So now pressing your whole pelvis into the floor. Protect your back and lift both legs off the floor. Flex the foot. Now bend the out, knees in, mermaid tail, and straighten the legs back out. Now double time. Knees in and back. Heels in and back. Heels in and back. Heels in. Four more. Yes. Heels in and back. And the back, back of the neck is super long, guys. Now mermaid tail, hold it here. Pressing up and up and up. And up. If you're feeling any twinge in the lower back, you want to suck the stomach in harder. It's up and up. Flex the foot like crazy. The reason our feet don't like to flex right now because it's easier not to flex. Now start to press, lift the upper body up as well if that's fine by you. And it's eight, seven, six, and five. Here's four, three, and two. Hold it there. And five, four, three, and two. Well done, everybody. Really release now. Have a quick wiggle. Wiggle out, wiggle out. And now roll back onto your back. Be careful. Roll back onto your back. Yeah. Very careful. Remember, we just did a long sequence on the back. Now slowly one knee above the hips. One knee and now the other knee above the hips. And very slowly draw both legs in. Yeah, you're going to go. It's a nice back stretch. You're going to go in because we're going to end with some tricep push up. Yeah, I know. Oh my God. Have a quick stretch from here. Release, let's release the back before we go to anything else. So now bring it, the knees back over the hips and now open the arms our way. Pressing the whole lower back into the floor and take a twist. So very slowly, yeah. And now breathe in back to center and breathe out over to the other side. Turning the head as well, both shoulders securely on the floor, inhale back there to center. Now the lower back should feel a beautiful massage. Inhale back to center, exhale out to the other side. Now, whichever side you are, now take yourself to the side that is trickier for you. Take yourself to the side that presents you a bit more challenge and then hold that stretch. I, I always like to go to the side that is just a bit, you know, a bit more awkward for me. And in a way, they are more exciting to work with. You know, do you notice the improvement or you notice, oh, it's really stiff. Okay, so it really needs that stretch today. And it's all good. Any discovery about the body, always good. Five, four, 
three. Ladies, now over to the other side. Let's release, uh, make sure the back is nice and loose and release before we go to our final work. That let's try to push up and all that stuff. Well done, guys. Hold the stretch. Five. I mean, the class is called fun stretch. I really should make sure I fit some stretch in, everyone. Now, half a quick shake out and a quick, quick set of uh, triceps. But we've done a lot of planks and all those arms, but you know, never too, never too much little. So here we go. We all know the deal, fingertips pointing at the bum. The reason I like the tricep is I like this bit because it really gets all the back, everything on your back. It's like a big finisher. So now, lean back, chest open, shoulders are externally rotated. Yep. And now lean back and lift up. Let's go bend and stretch and bend and stretch and bend and stretch and bend. Nice. So you might feel like your arms very burned, but really I'm looking forward to the tabletop and bend. That, that tabletop really just combine every, all the work we've done on our back, yeah? And bend, and stretch, two more, bend. Now hover halfway, guys, hold it here. Now elbows in, and in, and in, and in. Go in, and in, and in. That's four more. Now watch out for the combination. Hold it here, guys, from here. One drop, one elbow. One drop, one elbow. Cause up and down, horizontal. Up and down, sideways, and drop horizontal and drop four more like this and four and squeeze and three and squeeze last two and squeeze last one now straighten the arms and press up ready ready all the work in the hamstrings and the glutes and the back in one beautiful combination now knees together tap tap the knees together bend the knees yes and tap keep the glutes high yes up knees tap and tap and tap it out and five and four. Now guys, super glue the knees together. Now lift, lift, and lift with the glutes going up. Oh my God. It's your last eight and we're done. Yes. And up, and up, and up. Knees together. Yes. Last four, three, and two. Well done, everybody. Come on down. <laughs> nice one. Now straighten the legs out. Again, shoulders back, shoulders back. And now breathe in, lift. And then breathe out. Start to press the belly button forward. Nice. Now it's a surrendering. Do not, never, never stress about how far. You, wherever you end up, you end up there. Yeah. Now your belly button is leading the way, so it's a bit of a flat back. And then press forward. It's a very big one for the hamstring. And then at the last few, last few breaths, just completely relax over. Five. Did so well, guys. Everyone. Now just stretch out that back. Now coming up, you're, you're being by your belly button, but you're still pulling forward. So the power pulling you back is as strong as power pulling you forward and you go to a nice round back. Ah, oh, spine stretch, a nice round over spine stretch. Woo! And now sitting up nice and tall and then bend. So I bring one knee to my chest. I to get that foot over to that big old four. Yeah. And the most important is this bottom ankle is not the bottom leg is not flopping around. It's nice and upright. And then you, you then start to push your body forward until such a time, maybe you cradle your leg. <laughs> it's a horror, it's a big one. It's a big one for the glutes, yeah. And five, four, three, two. Nice one, breathe in and breathe out. And then gently swap the legs over. Take it across. And start, start off nice and chill. Start off nice and chill. Keeping that knee out and then press yourself forward and keep pressing forward. Eventually you hold. Yeah. Breathe. Five. Four. Three. Two. Nice one. Now go into a straddle. So use the legs up. Don't worry about how high. Yeah, exactly. Don't worry about how far open you are. Yeah. And if you find that you're ever so slightly tipped back, I'm exaggerating, yeah? You're a bit tight. You trip yourself right up on your sitting bone. Nice one. From the here, like so, breathe in and breathe out. Start to, start to just press forward. Wherever you can feel this out in the side, it's all good. And then you can just start to inch forward. The toes stay pointing at the sky. The toes stay pointing at the sky, yeah? Breathe. Five. Four. Three, 
too. And now you and now walking back using your abs to walk yourself back, breathing lengthen. You can keep one hand behind you, lengthen, and then go to a side stretch. Be both butt cheeks firmly on the floor. Ah, oh, breathe and five, four, three, two. Nice one. Slowly lower back, and then maybe resting that hand back on behind you. Take a deep breath in and reaching back. Both butt cheeks firmly on the floor. There should be no daylight. And five, four, three, two. Nice and gently forward. And let's go to our toes. Yes. So now really make an effort to really spread out those toes, especially that little one. Use your hands if you must. And let's get down there. <laughs> You're on a timer, everybody. Well done. That was so, I hope that was as good for you as it is for me. That was so good for me. <laughs> hope it's as good because I'm not even doing anywhere like as much work as you guys are doing. <laughs> and it's great for me. <laughs> Last 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two, guys. Oh, I kick it out. Oh my God, you guys are amazing. Let me stop the recording. Thank you.